Oil is a lubricating oil commonly used in engines, especially in vehicle engines. There are many varieties and types of oil depending on the type of engine. Without oil, engine components will not work properly. Its slippery texture helps to reduce the wear and tear on the rubbing engine components. Thus, these components become more durable. Without oil, engine components will work harder, which can reduce engine efficiency. Therefore, using the right oil will ensure that the engine works optimally. If you're curious as to what the oil making process is like, let's take a look at how this liquid oil is made. The process of making oil starts with drilling oil wells to extract crude oil from beneath the Earth's surface. This drilling can be done onshore or offshore, depending on the location of the oil reserves. This drilling usually requires advanced technology to ensure the crude oil can be extracted efficiently and safely. The resulting crude oil is then collected and transported to an oil refinery for the next stage. The next step is the crude oil separation process. Once the crude oil arrives at the oil refinery, it is heated in a large separation tower. This process involves heating the oil to such high temperatures that the oil boils and vaporizes. The oil vapor is then cooled back down to a liquid in various levels of separation towers that separate the crude oil into parts based on their boiling points. The resulting components or parts include various products such as gasoline, diesel, and oil-based parts that will be used to make engine oil. Entering the next process, the oil base that has been separated from the crude oil needs to be refined to remove impurities and contaminants. This refining can involve various methods such as the process of separating solid particles from liquids or gases, chemical processes used in the oil processing industry to remove impurities and other chemical processes. This separation process helps to remove solid particles from the raw material. This refining process is important to produce a clean, high-quality base oil that will form the basis of the engine oil we use. After the refining process, the next stage is the addition of additives to the oil. These include various types of ingredients to improve engine performance and protection. For example, detergents are added to keep the engine clean, antioxidants help prevent oxidation, and anti-corrosion agents protect engine components from rust. In addition, anti-wear agents serve to reduce wear and tear on engine parts. All these additives are carefully blended according to the designed formula, ensuring that every drop of oil provides optimal quality and protection. After the base oil is refined and additives are added, the next step is mixing. In this stage, the base oil and additives are mixed in a large tank in predetermined proportions. Blending is important to ensure that the additives are evenly mixed and give the oil optimal performance. This process is carried out under close supervision to ensure that the oil produced meets high quality standards. After all stages have been carried out, the next process is quality testing. The blended oil then undergoes various quality tests. These tests include viscosity checks to ensure the oil has the right thickness, flash point tests to determine the temperature at which the oil begins to burn, and pour point tests to determine the lowest temperature at which the oil can still flow. In addition, the oil is also tested for oxidation stability and insight to ensure optimal performance. After passing a series of quality tests, the oil is ready for the packaging process. The oil is placed in appropriate containers, such as plastic bottles or drums, with labels that include important information, such as oil type, viscosity, and production date. The packaging process is done meticulously to avoid contamination and maintain product quality. Once packaged, the oil is distributed to various markets through well-organized distribution channels. The product is then available at parts stores, repair shops, and vehicle maintenance centers, ready for use by consumers.
In the automotive world, engine oil is essential for cars and motorcycles. It lubricates engine parts to reduce friction and prevent wear and tear. It also helps keep the engine cool and removes dirt that can interfere with its performance. In other words, engine oil ensures that the engine runs smoothly and efficiently. Changing engine oil must be done periodically. Because the need for oil increases with the increase in the number of vehicles, many people take advantage of this opportunity to produce counterfeit oil. The use of counterfeit oil is very dangerous for the health of the vehicle, especially the engine components. There are a number of impacts caused by using fake oil for the engine. First, the engine will be easier to break down. The use of original oil will make the engine life longer and its performance remains stable. On the other hand, if you use fake oil, this causes the engine life to be short because it is often damaged. In the long run, using fake oil can cause the engine to break down. You see, fake oil is unable to lubricate the various components in the engine. Second, there is sludge in the engine. When the engine has broken down, there is usually a thick sludge or clump of oil in the engine cavity. This condition is referred to as oil sludge. Oil sludge is caused by oxidized impurities formed due to sludge, combustion residue, or oil scale mixed with new lubricant. The combustion residue will clump and stick to the surface of the engine components. The presence of oil sludge in the engine can clog small engine oil channels, so the engine cannot work optimally. Therefore, the impact can make engine components quickly damaged to the point of potentially breaking down. Third, the easiest impact to feel is that the engine pull feels heavier. This happens because fake oil produces dirt deposits that make components in the engine such as pistons, valves, and so on, unable to function optimally. Fourth, the engine will feel hot quickly. Fake oil certainly does not work optimally compared to the original oil from the manufacturer. In the long run, the use of fake oil causes the engine to heat up quickly, overheat. This condition is caused because fake oil is unable to provide maximum lubrication in the engine. As a result, friction occurs between components to cause excessive heat in the engine. Such is the long and detailed process of making oil until it is ready to be used to keep the performance of our vehicle engines optimal, starting from the extraction of crude oil to the final packaging, and the impact of using fake oil on vehicle engines. So, stay alert when buying oil to avoid getting fake oil. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe.